When it comes to learning about the past, there are currently no options for time travel, so researchers must rely on our ability to piece together the clues that have been left for us in the present. Almost all areas of our world have such clues if only you know what you are looking for. From learning about the construction of ancient Egyptian pyramids to creating a picture of the early days of our universe, there is no limit to the puzzles that can be solved. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we will be looking at three recent discoveries and what they meant for our understanding of the past. Cosmic Particles in Egypt's Bent Pyramid Analyzed for Clues It seems that the vestiges of mummies and the untold riches of the rulers of ancient Egypt are not the only things lurking among the ghosts inside the Egyptian pyramids. A recent announcement made by an international team of researchers with the Heritage Innovation Preservation Institute have announced that they will be conducting analysis on cosmic particles collected inside a bent pyramid one of Egypt's most famous ancient structures that was constructed around 4,600 years ago. They are hoping that this data will provide valuable information about how Bent Pyramid was built to confirm one of several theories regarding how it was ultimately erected. This study sought to measure muons, which are a type of subatomic radiographic particle that resemble a much heavier electron. Plates were placed within Bent Pyramid to collect these particles, which pass through empty space but are absorbed and deflected by harder surfaces. The muon accumulation on these plates will hopefully allow researchers to analyze the thermal anomalies that were reported within Bent Pyramid by the Scan Pyramids project earlier this year to uncover some of the enduring construction mysteries surrounding the pyramid. The Bent Pyramid, which is so named because of its unique sloping sides, is notable among Egypt's many periods as researchers believe that it may have been one of the first attempts at constructing a smooth-sided pyramid. Constructed by Pharaoh Snefru around 2600 BC and located within the royal necropolis of Dashur, Bent Pyramid is a hallmark example of the development of early pyramids into the more elaborate and complex models of later dynasties. As a model acting as the transition between step-sided and smooth-sided pyramids, knowledge about the technicalities behind its construction can potentially shed light on both genres of pyramids. For example, some believe that ancient Egyptians tasked with making the steep, smooth sides with little to no precedent noticed that the angle made it much more unstable, subsequently reducing the angle at the top to prevent collapse and giving the structure its trademark bent appearance. It is hoped that the analysis of results provided by thermal technology combined with muon detection will give archaeologists and researchers clues as to how the pyramid was constructed, knowledge which will be especially impactful considering the transitional features of bent pyramid. Hani Halal, the Vice President of the Heritage Innovation Preservation Institute, spoke about the importance of what the Scan Pyramids project could tell us, saying, For the construction of the pyramids, there is no single theory that is 100% proven or checked. They are all theories and hypotheses. What we are trying to do with the new technology, we would like to either confirm or change or upgrade or modify the hypothesis that we have on how the pyramids were constructed. How the magnificent ancient Egyptian pyramids were constructed to such epic proportions while lacking modern tools and equipment is one of the most enduring mysteries of all time and has forced researchers to get ever more creative in their search for answers. Hopefully, the analysis of these cosmic dust particles will shed some light onto construction secrets that have been kept for thousands of years. oldest dust ever spotted in the universe seen in distant galaxy. Dust has long been a reveler of secrets, exposing who has neglected to polish their trinkets or how long something has laid untouched. However, researchers have applied a more cosmic use to dust particles, specifically those which are formed and scattered after explosions caused by a short-lived supernova dramatically expiring. The early days of the universe 
were full of these explosions and subsequently full of the resulting dust particles which scattered across the universe, and recently astronomers may have spotted some of the first stardust ever created in a faraway galaxy. The dust was observed in galaxy A2744 YD4 at a time when the universe was only 600 million years old, by researchers viewing the location through the Atacama Large Millimeter Submillimeter Array. Although 600 million years old might seem like an unimaginably long time for some, in the context of the formation of the universe, it is but the blink of an eye. At a time when supernovas were some of the earliest formed stars in the universe, likely having begun appearing some 400 million years after the Big Bang, locating dust from early supernova explosions is an incredibly exciting find for researchers. Mikhail Mikhailovsky, an astrophysicist with the University of Edinburgh, mentioned his excitement for the find and what it means for astrophysicists in the field like himself. Dust is ubiquitous in nearby and more distant galaxies, but has, until recently, been very difficult to detect in the very early universe. This paper presents the most distant galaxy for which dust has been detected. This dust was detected by Nicholas Laporte and some of his colleagues with the University College London, as Laporte said that we are probably seeing the first stardust of the universe. And finding such an early example of stardust is huge for how scientists view and study the origins of our universe. Upon analysis, Laporte and his colleagues discovered that the supernova dust was ionized with a positive charge, indicating that the gas from the galaxy itself is similarly ionized. Researchers believe that ionization is what allowed the structures of the universe to begin to emerge as particles no longer interacted in strictly neutral ways. This switch from neutral atoms to ionized particles is known as reionization. And Michalowski suggested that the discovery of ionized particles provides evidence that at least a fraction of cosmic reionization was caused by galaxies like A2744 YD4. Essentially, this discovery provides a definitive mark on the timeline of early galaxy formation that appears to corroborate current hypotheses about ionization-driven changes within the early cosmos. While previous studies of early galaxies have been limited to recording the number, size and colors, now complex analysis of dust can provide a more quantitative look at the exact mechanics behind this formation. Study of the composition of the dust itself and subsequent notation of the abundances of oxygen, silicon and other heavier elements can also help to date the galaxies. As the fewer heavy elements present, the younger the galaxy is likely to be. This discovery is a huge one for researchers attempting to piece together the puzzle of how the universe formed and will likely act as a major clue for future studies and analysis. Cataclysmic Collision with Sausage Galaxy Reshaped Milky Way in Distant Past As far as galaxies go, the Milky Way is a rather oddly shaped one due to its inner bulge and outer ring, which forms a sort of halo around it. Scientists have never been quite sure why it is shaped this way, but a recently formed hypothesis might provide some answers at long last. In the new theory, which was proposed by a group of international researchers, the scientists suggest that the Milky Way was forever changed by a chaotic collision with a much smaller galaxy that may have taken place between 8 and 10 billion years ago. This much smaller, sausage-shaped dwarf galaxy was effectively destroyed by its fateful crash with our own, much larger galaxy, essentially erasing it from the universe. However, the dwarf was not entirely gone, as the fallout from the suspected collision left the remains of some stars scattered in the region. Vasily Belakurov with the University of Cambridge and the Center for Computational Astrophysics at the Flatiron Institute in New York City explained in a statement that the collision ripped the dwarf to shreds, leaving its stars moving in very radial orbits that are long and narrow like needles. He then said that the paths of these remaining stars are very close to the center of our galaxy. This is a telltale sign that the dwarf galaxy came in on a really eccentric orbit and its fate was sealed. 
The journey of these stars can be reconstructed into a telling saga recounting the collision and their subsequent travels through our own Milky Way. When paths were recreated in this manner, the figure of the original dwarf galaxy was able to be seen for the first time. And what they found was a distinctive sausage shape, earning the long-dismantled galaxy the nickname Gaia Sausage. Although the collisions of galaxies are not at all unusual and are in fact happening all around us at this very moment, tracking the past encounters of our own Milky Way can help us to get a clearer picture of how it came to look and act the way it does today. There is no way to travel through time to observe what happened as the universe was formed. Finding remnants from long past activities such as this can be crucial in helping us to reconstruct what our world may have looked like long before life was ever sparked. The discovery of this strange sausage galaxy is important because it helps researchers gain a clearer understanding of why our Milky Way is shaped so strangely. But what do you make of these fascinating discoveries? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.